What's up guys, it's Walter, I'm back. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'll explain why. And I'm also gonna talk about the Apple event that just happened with the Apple Watch, the MacBook that just got released, and a couple other things. So let's get right into it. So the most recent event that Apple just had was their Spring Forward event. And they talked about a couple different things. They talked about the new MacBook, uh, Apple Watch, they touched on that again. Uh, new software that they released, uh, like the research kit. And they also dropped the price on the Apple TV. Now, let's talk about the Apple Watch. Now, the Apple Watch actually will begin to uh, accept, uh, Apple will accept uh, pre-orders uh, beginning April 10th. Uh, now that's going to be a pre-order and preview so the way that they're going to do it is they're gonna allow you to start the pre-order process you'll be able to go to the retail store and actually take a look at the watch try it on see which band fits best for you um, and then be able to pick it up on the 24th uh, that's the way that they're going to kind of see which watch is going to need to be what locations um, there's pricing finally available for it so the sport model the apple watch sport in a 38 millimeter is going to be 349 and the 42 is going to be 399 the watch the apple watch uh, which is the steel version of it is going to be 549 and the 42 is going to be 599 now this can go as high as a thousand ninety nine dollars depending on the band that you get now the most expensive and most ridiculous um, Apple watch is the Apple watch edition which starts at ten thousand dollars so you can go from ten thousand to seventeen thousand on that watch itself um, something they didn't mention in the keynote or at least I didn't catch is that it is splash resistant uh, so pretty much you can go into the shower or wash your hands with it or you know if water falls on it but it's not waterproof uh, it has 18 hours of battery life and it will essentially get you through a full day uh, they have bands already available on the website uh, which start off at $49 for the rubber fluorescent bands up to $4.99 for the link bracelets uh, the charging cables are also there as well as an accessory um, $29 for the 38 millimeter and uh, I mean $29 for the 38 millimeter and $39 for the 42 millimeter let's move on to the MacBook uh, that just got released. Um, I thought they were going to release a new MacBook Air, but they actually brought back uh, the MacBook line. Um, they went ahead and did a 12 inch Retina display. Um, it's really thin, it's 13.1 millimeters thin. It weighs just two pounds. Uh, so it's extremely thin, really light. Uh, they went ahead and did something different on this one from the other ones. Uh, there's three colors it's there's gold the space gray and silver and the other thing that I really like about it is that they brought force touch onto the to the trackpad uh, so you can actually go ahead and do different actions with that force touch they went ahead and did the USB type C connector and that's gonna work for power for uh, for connecting it to different displays and be able to do the adapters uh, for regular USB so it is going to require you buying some dongles so that is pretty much everything on the new MacBook that they released um, now to why I've been gone uh, the reason why I've been gone is because my girlfriend just had a baby um, we went ahead and wanted to get everything together uh, so we did all the planning and getting the baby nursery together and then also after the baby was born I wanted to go ahead and just get some time to bond with the baby and get into a routine uh, so that's why I've been gone uh, I'm back so if you have any suggestions for videos uh, things that you want to see on the channel don't hesitate to go ahead and let me know in the comments um, do keep um, liking my videos and you know subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet it helps me out a lot uh, and I'll catch you guys in the next video thanks we <laughs>